right, everybody. Uh, we started the next build. Going to take this bed off. I'm running the forklift. We cut all the bolts out from underneath it. We slid it out so that the, it's away from the frame. And now we're going to position it and get ready to lift it, just like all the other ones. So this is technically day one and a half because yesterday I cut all the bolts out from underneath it and they had four more to do today and Herb and uh, Jake got those. Uh, we removed the mud flaps, had to reposition the, the wires. See the, the, this is the newer model and everything came in here instead of on the bumper. So I had to remove all that yesterday. And we got it hanging by the frame. We'll have to build something for it to attach to. So day one and then we're gonna put this bed on it. So this bed is, uh, we have to unbolt a lot of crap off that. I'm gonna move this now. And then, hey, look at my new truck. I just got this yesterday. This is a uh, DNR, uh, I think it was a Forester's rig. It's a 2008 four wheel drive. And then I got this sweet 125 gallon slip tank for it. that out so I gotta bolt that down had to pressure wash everything um, so there'll be a nice little uh, I don't know type it's gonna be a type 7 for our agency uh, maybe a patrol rig uh, could be it's, I'm gonna put a uh, plow on it for the winter so yeah pretty excited about that got that all I uh, got it yesterday about 4 in the afternoon pressure wash the bed out and cleaned it up a little bit a lot of work to do inside it came from the coast a lot of mold a lot of mold that i gotta take care of so yeah that'll be another project that's my personal project so i'll keep updating that too anyway getting ready to move that bed so stay tuned all right we got the chassis out from underneath that now i gotta figure out where we're gonna put it We got the deck down. We're doing the dance. Uh, Herb's gonna move the chest out of the way. We're gonna move that old brush truck back into the or into the bay. We gotta start unbolting stuff and getting it ready to take off. So, uh, like everything around here, it goes fairly fast. I mean, we did that other truck basically in 14, 14 days, and. Uh, we're just waiting on a few parts. Now we're doing the dance. I'm going this way. He's backing up. Trying to get out of the way here. Lots of exciting things going on. Stay tuned. All right. Rush 92. Conconelli. The town up, so we're gonna remove that box. We gotta remove the mud flap. Jake's over here working on the box. And then we got some wiring we have to unhook that's attached to the bed for the uh, rear rear pump. So that's, that's the next step that we're working on. Saying, no, the monitor right now. no, there isn't. Okay. So we're waiting on parts for uh, from the oh, agency. Wow. So it's under its own power, first time. Replace those uh, drive lines. That's what she looks like. We're polish those boxes. Yeah, polish those boxes up, make them look nice. Looks good. We put those drive lines, the rear one we put on last night and then the front one we did this today, so. And then, uh, yeah. And then we're working on this still. Getting almost ready to take the bed off. Okay, so the bed's all disconnected. All the wires have been disconnected. All the bolts, everything is ready to lift. So we're gonna lift this. However, Herb's getting ready to paint this. So he's gonna paint this and it'll probably be set up in the next day. 
and uh, we'll be able to set the bed on it tomorrow. So there you go. Just only what a day and a half of work. Already getting this painted. That deck's ready to come off. And then ready to bolt onto this. Not bad. So, anyway, check in next time. I'm going to close out the video for today. It's been a long day. So, take care. Bye.